Welcome to Ebidency. In this video, you will see the introduction part of CAN protocol. CAN stands for Controller Area Network. CAN is a asynchronous serial communication protocol or hope you are aware about the serial asynchronous and synchronous in asynchronous sender transmits synchronization signal to receiver for establishing the synchronization well, it is originally developed for automotive networks to reduce the weight and wiring harnesses of a vehicle by power wash Let's see the canvas representation in a system. We will take a car as an example for it. In a car, we will see different canons ABS, gearbox, traction, engine, and speed. All these are called as canons. And these nodes are connected like this. All nodes attached to a common connection. This connection is done with twisted pair cable. Typically, all the nodes will operate in a same quadrant. It is a off duplex, so it supports only broadcast, but unicast and multicast can be achieved with some logics we will see it later. Canvas supports up to 1 MBPS. High speed canvas supports 512 kbps. Low speed canvas supports 128 kbps. Each node controls some functions. For example, ABS controls the anti braking system, and gearbox controls gear, and speed unit controls the speed. Each function has an identifier associated with it. We will take this as a reference. In this, node 3 has two messages that is, message ID 6 command to unlock or lock trunk. Message ID 7 is status of trunk door open or close the baud rate is 500 kbps and this work will be done by the system engineer so set mcu can register to match with the id and baud rate of the canvas and write application code to process the messages. This work will be done by the application engineer. The system designer must specify the identifier of each node and the messages that the node will transmit. Application code will construct transmitted messages and interpret received messages. CAN protocol is standardized by International Standards Organization ISO and Society of Automotive Engineers ACAE. CAN High Speed is ISO 118982. It supports up to 1MBBS per speed. CAN Low Speed also known as fault tolerance 
is represented by ISO 1898 version 3 and supports of group 125 KBBS. CAN bus is a robust protocol. The application of CAN is uh, available in all the industries like automotive, medical, agriculture, marine, industrial, and defense. Let's see the network model. We know ISO OSI network layers. Application, representation, session, transport, network, data link, and physical. These are the seven network layers. In this data link and physical is supported by the CAN. Actually, can suppose these two. If the user wants others five, then they need to go with any high level protocol like can open and J1939. You will see the can high speed physical layer. This is the hardware representation of the can high speed physical layer. Here, VCC is 4.5 volt to 5.5 volts. PNs and RX are digital input output to the microcontroller. CAN H that is CAN I and CAN L is CAN low. Differential bus voltage is varies between 0 to 3.0 volt. Differential voltage is greater than 1 means dominant that is 0. If it is less than 0.5, it is called recessive that is 1. We will take this CR output of canvas with a single node. Here the top one represents the CAN TX that is same CO side and the CAN RX is represented by Last that is bottom and the can H can F that is the actual bus canvas is in the center. Can TX that is I R1 recession is will be like this in this line and can low or zero dominant in TXI will be represented like this. Here VD is less than 0 0.5 volt that is resistant and VD is greater than 1 volt that is dominant. We can understand it, the voltage levels in this diagram. Let's move to the key features of canvas. Can is fast and drops. message based and it is not uh, address based protocol it supports point to point and multicast messaging new mode can be added easily as it doesn't have any overhead of address based communication. So this is the end of introduction to CAN protocol. We will see the rest in the upcoming videos. Thanks for watching. If you have any queries or suggestion, please post it in the comments. If you really like this video, please hit the like button. If you want to get more updates, or more videos like this, please subscribe to our channel.